In this video, we will learn about the torque boost function on IS7. Torque boost is available when the control mode is set to VF. The larger the torque boost, the greater the voltage output during the initial startup. Torque boost could be used when the motor doesn't rotate properly at low speed, and when large load requires large starting torque during initial operation. The torque boost function can be used to increase the initial torque performance. Torque boost can be useful for vertical loads such as elevators, lifts, cranes, or for centrifugal loads such as agitators and centrifuges. Torque boost function includes manual torque boost, auto torque boost, and advanced auto torque boost. The manual torque boost function allows users to adjust the boost amount by setting a fixed value directly, while the auto torque boost's boost amount is automatically calculated by the drive to match the load conditions and output the voltage. Advanced Auto Torque Boost is a function in which the drive determines the load based on the manual torque boost and adjusts the boost amount on its own. Let's learn how to set up Manual Torque Boost. The torque boost function on IS7 is set in the DRV group. You can set the type of torque boost, forward torque boost value, and reverse torque boost value in each parameter. Let's learn how to set manual torque boost parameters using the keypad. Press the mode key to enter the parameter group. Select the type of torque boost at DRV15 using the directions keys. Set the torque boost amount at DRV16 using the directions keys. Find and set the correct load condition by 0.5% or 1%. Let's learn how to set up Auto Torque Boost. Auto Torque Boost requires motor information input and auto tuning as it uses motor values. Motor information can be obtained from the motor nameplate. Please input information such as motor capacity, rated voltage, and rated current in DRV and BAS groups. After entering motor information, auto-tuning must be performed at BAS 20. If the motor is not connected to the load, select Rotary Tuning 1 All. And if it is difficult to remove the gear and belt or remove the load, select Static Tuning 2 All or Static Type. Let's learn how to set Auto Torque Boost parameters using the keypad. Press the Mode key to enter the parameter group. Perform the auto tuning at BAS 20 using the directions keys, assuming that the motor information has already been entered. When auto tuning is complete, Set the type of torque boost at DRV15 using the directions keys. Let's learn how to set up the Advanced Auto Torque Boost. The function of the Advanced Auto Torque Boost is to output the drive's voltage to the load by adjusting the boost amount on its own without the auto tuning. Advanced Auto Torque Boost is different from Manual Torque Boosts. When using Advanced Auto Torque Boost, DRV16 reflects the amount of torque boost during motoring operation. 
and DRV-17 reflects the amount of torque boost during regenerative operation. DRV-27, ADV, ATB, M gain, and 28, ADV, ATB, G gain is the value to adjust compensation amount according to the load. They are used when there is insufficient torque or excessive current during starting the motor. Let's learn how to use the keypad to set up the advanced auto torque boost parameters. Press the mode key to enter the parameter group. Select the type of torque boost at DRV15 using the directions keys. Set the amount of torque boost at DRV16 for motoring rotation and DRV17 for regenerating rotation. Set the filter gain value for the calculation of the advanced auto torque boost at DRV26. Set the gain value for the calculation of the advanced auto torque boost at DRV27 and 28 for the reverse auto torque boost value, the regeneration auto torque boost value. If the torque boost amount is set too low, it may not be able to overcome the inertia of the load. And if the torque boost amount is set too large, it may cause the overheating of the motor and result in heat damage. Auto torque boost and advanced auto torque boost differ from manual torque boost in the level of voltage output depending on the load applied. So in the following video, we will test with the manual torque boost function. As with the formula on screen, the larger the value you set by adjusting the output voltage, the higher the initial output voltage when the torque boost is 5%, when the torque boost is 10%, 15% torque boost, Until now, we have learned about the torque boost function on IS-7.